Alright, welcome or welcome back, new viewers and gamers. It is time for a new episode of the Paper Mario TZYD Remake playthrough. And today, you might be wondering why I happen to be in Hooktail's castle. Well, you see this little crack in the wall? Our good boy Merlin next to Professor Franklin's house wanted me to blow it up to find something there, so let us see what it is and begin. Alright, there's a little switch over here. Now, what's behind the switch? Alright, if the pages are getting torn, how are we still here? Or whatever, it doesn't matter. Alright, you got. And up arrow. It's unclear what this means. You should ask someone super. Who could that be? Why, none other than Merlin Boy himself. So why don't we get Yoshi out here and this damn Joy-Con drift is annoying me. Let's get Yoshi out here and run our way out of this castle. I just keep running, they say. Alright, we're almost to the end of the castle once again. And this guy runs with me, but that's alright. We don't have to worry about him. Alright, let's just run away. They're of no use to us. Let's go. Right, back to warp port with us. If I can get into the warp pipe. Don't have to wait for those anymore. Finally found a better way to avoid him. Alright, Merlin, I got what you were looking for. Why don't we have Bobbery Boy in the front if this Joy-Con drift is pissing me off? Anyways. Hmm, what is that in your hand? What's this? An up arrow? An up arrow? Up? Hmm. Of course! This is the Ultra Stone. So that is what the star sign meant. I picked this up at a flea market years ago and forgot it was in the attic. With this, I can power up your partners even more. We are cooking now. Care to power up a partner right this minute. Yes, I do, and first, I think Bombery Boy should get it. Like I mentioned earlier in the game, he has the highest HP of every partner, so it's good to make him as tanky as possible. Sazibi. Sazubi. Oh, 
ultimate power is within him. Okay, it's a power more. And we got enough for just one more. Why don't we do Gumbella this time? Because there's a certain attack that Gumbella gets at Ultra Rank that is exceptionally very good. Because alongside Baby Yoshi and Vivian, she's also considered one of the best partners in this game because of this specific attack. Can't power up more. I'm afraid we can't do any more for now. And so now back to the partner list. Goombella has now learned Rally Wink. Not only does she have 30 HP instead of 20 now, but she'll wink on Mario to give him the courage for an extra action. People call this so good that he's a, she's essentially two Marios instead of just one just because of this one attack. And as for Bomberry, he has now learned the strongest attack in the game that isn't a special attack. Bomb 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 bast. Bomb bomb bast, that's what it's called. Attacks all enemies with a massive blast, just like Mega Bomb with Bomb in the first game. That's all that really is. But now, he also has 40 HP. So, he can take the most hits of any partner in the game. But anyways, since that was pretty short-lived, why don't we go talk to the Don? So we can get to the Exodus Express. Actually, I want to see what this guy has first. Alright, he's got the Jumpman badge, which once equipped it, it will increase the power of your jump by one, but you lose the ability to use your hammer. Timing tutor? I don't think I need that. Yeah, I don't think that's any useful. I kind of want the Jumpman badge, actually. This could be pretty useful in some cases. I don't really use it most of the time, but... Yeah, why not? Let's buy it. We got ourselves a Jam and Jelly if we ever need it. I don't think so, though. So why don't we go to the normal bad shop too before we go see the Don? First attack for call is call. Eh, I don't see anything too useful over here. Yeah, these badges kinda suck, I'll be honest. Yeah, nothing too useful. All right, go back. Didn't mean to read the sign. All right, we're at the better side of the town, and we're gonna use Bombery for a split second. Let's open this crack on the wall. And get this here shine sprite. Alright, we can power up at least one more partner, but we got some business with the Dion himself first, as well as a star piece. Alright, Gabello come in front. If this Joy-Con drift would fuck off. What happened to him? Oh no. That's not beyond the syndicate boss. He's looking a bit grim, even for a mobster. Think he's okay? Francesca. Oh, poor boss. The big man's been sick with loneliness ever since his daughter skedaddled. Underboss Frankie is gone and the boss is in shambles. What is syndicate to do? That script for gang of punk thieves is stealing jobs for us right and left. Hey, but enough about us and our stupid problems, huh? What can we do for yous? Well, take us for the ritzy, rit ritziest uh, train around for the exits express. Whoa, you want to take it for that Rowan Wingding? Oof, ain't nothing we can do about that. Yeah, us giving our tickets, that's rich. You gotta talk to the boss for that. Francesca. I just can't stand seeing the boss like this. If only we could help the boss see his daughter again. You mean Francesca and Frankie? Didn't we see them on Kill Hawk Mario? Who's on that what now? What did you just say? Repeat that. You know where the, the young Miss Beyonce is at? Really? No lie. 
I swear to you, if you're lying, I'll turn you to Fetty, so help me. Well, if that's where she is, then why didn't you just bring her back here, huh? Be a pal. We go ourselves, but we can't leave the boss unprotected, you get me? Yeah, you bring us young Miss Francesca. And we'll ask the boss to do something about your little t uh, train ticket situation. The ideal or what? That's like a hype, bub. Oh boy. See, now that's better. I knew once you understood our predicament, you couldn't refuse. Don't screw this up. Don't worry, boss. We'll be back. Uh oh, Francesca. Alright, I guess we're going back to Kyohoki again. We were literally just there. Actually, before we go down there, I can always go back and upgrade another partner real fast. Alright, Merlin, my boy, we need you again. Welcome to my home of Merlin. I can power up one of your partners for three shine spirits. So, which partner would you like me to power up? We're gonna do Vivian this time. Shazibi! Shazibi! Care to power up more. No more for now. Return someday. We very much have to, man. You're the best NPC in the game. But anyways, Vivian now has 3 HP and she now has new attack, Infatuate. Blow a kiss to all enemies to confuse them. Another not-so-useful attack, there's other ways you can confuse enemies using it, uh, items. Still more useful than this mouse, though. <laughs> but anyways, let's get back to the docks. This drift, oh my god. Alright, there we go. Hey, Cortez, we need a ride. And you know what they say, it's good to keep a record. <laughs> que pasa? Get going to Kehoki. Muy bien. The sea to sea we go. Set sails, destination, Kehoki. We can just skip all that, we don't need to see this. I don't think he turned his head in the original. Nice touch. Though a little creepy. Alright, now where are those two piantas? If I were two piantas in love, where would I- I didn't even need to go to- okay. Never mind. Doesn't matter. Completely forgot about the warp pipe. Alright, those fuzzies should still be running around, right? Doesn't look like they are. Here they are. Hey, you two, we need something. Oh, hey, it's Mario. How you been, dear pal? We do we do something for you? None at all. The boss is sick. Oh, poor daddy. Oh, no. And I had a time like this. You see, I, I just dropped the wedding ring Frankie gave me around here. I can't believe... I can't possibly leave until I find that ring, otherwise something may eat it. Hello, Aaron, how are you doing today? It must be somewhere between here and that skull rock. Listen for a second, my fuzzy little coconut. Shouldn't we forget about that ring for now and check on the boss? Well, you have a point. How much money did you spend on that ring, dude? How could you say that, Frankie? That ring was the symbol of our love. We have to find it. We have to. But your dad's also dying, just saying. Or maybe you just don't love me anymore, is that it? Maybe you don't love your father anymore, is that it, hmm? Of course I love you, my little bacon burger. None of your sweet talk now. You're going to have to say you love me a hundred times. 
a hundred times. If you love me, you have to say it, Frankie. Oh, come on now, babe. Of course I love you, my little short stack. Now, please, let's go. No, you have to say it 99 more times, Frankie. <sighs> Fine, you dizzy dame. I love you. 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 Yeah, buckle on. This is gonna take a while. I love you. 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 Ten times. I love you. 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 Anybody falling asleep yet? I love you. I love you. Still about a fifth of this to go. I love you. 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 I love you, 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 I love I know it is. I love you, 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 hat sixty nine nice. I love you, I love you, I love you. I love you, 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 oh god my voice. I love you, oh I love you, 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 and I love you, I love you. God damn it, never make me do that again. <sighs> they are sitting. Oh, Frankie, baby, you're such a silly pilly. <laughs> you screw you. Ugh. Now, my little cream puff, let's find a ring right away. What do you say? I wonder if these two are gonna be okay. No, they won't. Look, Mario, I think maybe we should help them. And the Blissey Raids are back, good to know. And anyways, where could that ring have gone out? Another one of these guys. I don't want to fight. Get away from me. Yeah, I might be in one of these bushes if I remember correctly. Alright, Yoshi, my boy. I need your help. This stupid drift. Alright, there we go. Or if I fall, no big deal. Oh, because of drift and Joy-Cons. Alright, run away! I need a smoke ball! Okay. Yes, we can raid him. Ah! Of course, they want me to fight these guys. Alright, uh, let's take you out. Oh, they don't give me star points anymore. Freeze him! Yes! Alright, normal hammer, and then we're gonna switch to Bobbery next turn. And now, here comes the strongest normal attack in the game. Six damage. All that for one star point. Well, damn. Oh my god, this Joy-Con drift. Better break this goddamn Joy-Con, dude. Excuse that sound. Now run away again.
Yeah, it looks like my controller finally decided to act right. Sometimes you just need to hit it a little bit. I'm not angry, just really need to... Uh, what am I call it? It's not a gamer rage. Sometimes I just hit my Joy-Con just to get it to stop drifting. Alright, anyways... And looks like it worked a little bit. Never mind. Now, let's see, where is that ring? I do have a pro controller, but I'd rather just stick with the Joy-Cons. I might even just consider using those pro controllers, actually. What do y'all think? Oh, there it is. Alright, you got a wedding ring. A pricely ring. The symbol of Frankie and Francesca's love. Wait, no, let's go back. I, I didn't... Oh, yeah, I killed that before. All right, we got your goddamn ring. Oh, hey, that, that's it, that's it. That's the ring, that's the ring you found it, pal. Frankie, and now we can go home to daddy. <laughs> we sure can, my little cheese and cracker. Let's go. Well, so anyway, We'll be down at the docks. Hurry back, please. Yeah, I don't blame you for getting angry at the Joy-Con drift. I mean, you think this drift is bad at the moment? I have another Joy-Con I used to use back in high school. That's been drifting like crazy and hasn't stopped. And I haven't used that thing in years. I think since early 2020. Here's where we just go back to the docks. And we'll actually... Nah, never mind. We'll just go the normal way. Okay, Mario, I think we're ready, pal. Yeah, we are. Let's go back to Rogue Point. Oh, Daddy, please hang on until we get there. All right, Cortez, que pasa? Need to go back to Rogue Point. Muy bien, we are off. Cast off to Rogue Point. We have to get and go see Daddy immediately. You go to Francesca. Hey, can you stop staring at me, dude? This is weird. Anyways, let's get running. And they are fast. Anyways. And thanks for that. Try to make him sound like a ghost of the pirate. Oh, wait. Wrong way. I wonder if Bombery might have anything to say about these guys. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy! Wake up, we'll open your eyes! Oh, really? Uh, why have you become a Generation 6 fan? Boss! Ever since you left the island, the boss situation just kept getting worse. This is just awful. And after the two of you came all the way back to. You. Come on, boss, speak to me! Jessica. Daddy! Boss! <laughs> oh, my little friend, Jessica. You came fucking back for me. And you too, Frankie. Of course we did, Daddy! As soon as we heard you were ill, we dropped everything and- No, you didn't. And rushed back! 
Francesca, Frankie, I was wrong. I was a stubborn old man. Forgive me. I know I may regret saying this, but I wanted to use to stay here with me. I can't bear to be away from you two lovebirds. I'm an old man now. I need peace. Oh, fuck out of here. You're fine. I guess the time has come for me to stop being so selfish, causing everyone trouble. Looks like even Don Beyonce, to, oh, the dawn of old on time to death, can't escape the old age. The time has come, everyone. I'm gonna retire. Daddy, boss, no! Whoa, boss, and I forgot what the last guy just said. No, it's time. I mean it. And I want you to be my successor, Frankie. What do you say, Frankie? As for today, you're the new head of the Pianta Saint again. What? B -b boss you still got it in you. You're a spring chicken. You don't got to do this. And, I mean, me, boss. <laughs> no, you're the one, Frankie. I've been thinking that for a long time now. You'll just, you're, you, you'll do just fine, kid. I got a feeling about you. A good one. I want you to take care of Francesca and the rest of the syndicate. And do you the way I did. Boss! You, Mario. It looks like you done you had another favor for me, kid. Yeah. Uh, about that, boss. Oh, this is gonna be beautiful, I know it. What do you guys do? Well, you uh we kinda promised him something, boss. We told him you'd we'd ask you about the ticket for the Excess Express if you brought your daughter. Whoa, ho 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 ho. Is that all? You had me worried for a second. <laughs> Come on over here, Mario. How many you want? One, two, ten? Help yourself. You got a train ticket. A ticket for the ritzy train to Poshley Heights. <laughs> you come back anytime you like. How about that? Whoa, whoa. Right up to his desk. <laughs> Whatever. Well, now that I've retired, I'm gonna get out of here. Daddy! Boss! You're the boss now, Frankie. You got that? You, the boss. You do good now, Frankie. God damn it. What a great man. Anyways. Frankie, we've got lots of work to do. And don't worry, little. I'll keep you in line. Sweeping, come on. Knock it off with the pet names nonsense. Will you? Call me Francesca. Uh... F Francesca. Yes, or it's bust. <laughs> Under boss. Uh, uh, I mean, boss, you got our loyalty. We'll be by your side whenever you need us, boss. Thank you so much, Mario, for everything. You're welcome here anytime. You're like a brother to me. No, I'm not. I've known you for like 10 minutes. You ain't bad, kiddo. Yeah. You ever think about joining up with the syndicate? It's the life, kid. Ah, shit, where do I sign up? Frank is nice, but you don't want to see him angry. He's called Furious Frankie. Once a hundred punks came after Frankie, when he was alone, and he ruined him. Ah, shit. You sure he wasn't just playing 100 Man Melee in one of the earlier Smash Bros. games? No? Okay. With Frankie around, ain't nothing to fear. He's wise beyond to stay in control. You're gonna support our brother, I mean our new boss? Yeah, that's it. We owe you big, Mario. We always seem to be in your debt, you know? If there's ever anything the Beyonce Syndicate can do it for you, just say the word. I wanna talk to her. Hold up, this damn joy contract. Frankie and I are going to keep the Beyonce family syndicate together. And maybe we'll start our own family. Oh, what am I thinking? <laughs> yeah, what are you thinking? Anyways. <laughs> now the boss is retired and we have the ticket to the Exus Express. Jolly good show. We'll show we'll reach Poshy the Heights in no time in time for tea. Hey, you drink tea? Hey, let's go fire up a cup right now before we go. Find that six star. The crystal star shouldn't be more taxing than a vacation, you know, huh? <laughs> I've heard that to my uglies. 
So the Six Crystal Star is in Pashi Ice, is it? That's a rather nice piece of information. Thanks ever so. Hmph! You're Beldum. You've never seen Beldum before. How do you know about her? Normally, uh, maybe Vivian told him I don't know. But other than that, normally, this would be where I finally deal with you and that sappy traitor Vivian. But something tells me that trying that alone might be unwise, so you live for now. Instead, I'll just beat you uh, to Pashley Heights and get that crystal star before you do. <laughs> Mario, that bode is, that bode is what? Ill. I, I suggest we reach Pashley Heights before that crony. Look alive, man. We are off to, to Rogueport Station. Yes, sir, Captain Sir. I want to see what this guy has to say. Hmm. The boss told me to look after this place. You do anything funny? I'll toss it like Dan. Yeah, maybe. Or like I mentioned before, Vivian might have said something about it. I do like that about uh, X and Y. You get two stars instead of just one. Speaking of which, still gotta do that Pokemon X and Y now, like, don't I? Anyways, let's see. You have anything new? I already have a double dip badge. Wait a minute. Yeah, double pain badge. Oh, that's different. Alright, double the damage Mario takes from enemies. Honestly, I'm about to just buy this for fun. Fuck it. I don't think I'll ever use it. It's mostly just a challenge badge, but I'll buy it for fun. <laughs> yeah, you're right about that. You still look like a Kirby character. Anyways. Alright, but now that we have the ticket, the boss is retired. Here's the train that we must go to. And you know what they say, it's good to keep a record. What a beautiful looking train. And we'll talk to this toad in the next episode, but I want to talk to a few people. Ah, there must be so many heartfelt reunions on this very spot. Ah, it's just deep, man. I love the thought of it. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna cry. Ah, hold up. There we go. All I ever think about is how this train cuts through the wind as it races across plains. Like a torpedo on Earth, slicing through the relentless winds. Isn't it just the coolest thing ever? I don't have the money yet, but my dream is to one day ride this train. I'll get working on that dream, dude. Anyways, I'm gonna have Goombell in the front. I wanna see what she has to say about this real fast. That's Porter, the station manager here in Rockport. He checks train tickets. I heard he loves trains so much that he has, like, a billion model trains at home. Where the hell would you hear that from? Maybe he's just using his adulthood to buy all of the things he wanted as a kid. Kinda like me. Uh, anyways. So in the next episode, now that we have the ticket, we will be going on this train to start Chapter 6 and search for the 6th stars... I almost said Star Spirit, Crystal Star. Anyways, if y'all enjoyed this and you want to see more, please leave a like, comment, subscribe, and follow. Hit with the VZC on screen right now if on YouTube, that bell button for more. May I give a special thank you to Aaron for joining me once again for this wondrous video. Plus, video sponsored by the wonderful people at Adobe. Just hit the link in the description below. Use the code provided to get a wonderful discount on your wonderful energy drink order. I recommend the Dragon Flitter. And what did you like and dislike about this video? And also, consider becoming a YouTube member for just $3 a month for access to certain perks like access to my Pokemon Surgeon's playthrough. Anyways, answer the question of the day as well. In the next episode, we take the train. Let us send this off with a quick raid for those of you on Twitch. Alright, you said you wanted me to raid Cracker, I will raid him. Alright, thank you all for watching and have a terrific day.